Emily, well, yeah. uh, before Friday, I think I'm going to actually the north of England on Friday, but I'm like Wednesday or Thursday, if you're around, I would like to take you for a drink somewhere. Oh, okay. Would you, would you like to do that? Sure. Cool. Hi guys, this is Sam talking to you from Westminster, and today I'm going to talk to you about a topic that it's pretty much left alone, underexplored, or people don't bear, into, bear in mind the proper nuances, the proper complexities of this issue. But essentially it's the idea of natural versus structured conversation. There's this idea that you have naturals who never need to learn anything, and then you have people who learn a technique or a system of conversation and intergender interaction in order to become like a natural or to achieve the same results as a natural. And I want to explore the nuances here. And the first point to make is that there is no such thing as a natural. When we talk about someone, look at someone, and we call them a natural, what really has happened is that from a very early age, they've had a number of experiences which have enforced this idea that they are okay with conversation. So when we take the example of a man who seems naturally confident or naturally comfortable around women, right? He seems good with women naturally. What's happened in almost every case is that he's had a very strong feminine female influence since he was a young child. That could be a maternal figure, a mother or an auntie or a sister, or from a young age he was around other females. But essentially, a natural is someone who's learned a structured approach. They've just learned it from a young age. As we know, the language learning capacities of babies are far, far greater than the language learning capacities of an adult. And it's exactly the same with conversation. Just as a child learns language, the alphabet, maths, literacy, they also learn social skills. Now, so what happens when you have a natural and someone who has to learn a structure? That natural has just done the same learning process. He's just done it when his brain was like a sponge. And so he's absorbed all of these nuances, all of these complexities, all of this incredibly important information and learning process. He's had that right from a young age, right from the age where his mind was able to absorb it quickly. And a lot of these people that you see maybe teaching some sort of structured game, perhaps they haven't had that same maternal affection and sort of female influence in their early childhood and so that imbalance as they were growing up that failure to be comfortable and natural with women needs now to be compensated for by learning a structure right now the second point is that any sort of structure any sort of conversational structure is essentially aiming to reverse engineer what a natural already does right the idea of learned conversation skills is that it is trying to make it seem like what a natural would do. So by learning to copy the natural behavior, we're able to go through the motions and start to become more natural with our learned communication. So if you're thinking, what is, you know, can I just be a natural? Can I just learn to be a natural? Or do I need to learn a structure of conversation? The way you should look at it is that structure, that structured conversation is like a foot in the door to becoming natural with it. If you don't have any skills, if you haven't learned anything right now, if you didn't have that motherly female influence in your early childhood, and now you have to compensate for that once you're older, then you need to get your foot in the door somehow. And learning a structure is the way to do that. Learning one structure though, I have to emphasize a big, big problem that guys face is they get so wrapped up in theory and content and this YouTuber and that YouTuber and this author and that author and this expert that they get muddled up in this sort of tangled web of expertise, but they never actually find one structure to follow all the way through. So if you are someone that wants to learn to improve your skills, to improve your conversation and communication skills, you've got to stick to one right? You can't just get tangled up in all of this YouTube content that's firing at you from all angles. This one will sing you a lullaby. It'll sing you a lullaby? Yeah, you just got to <laughs> twist a little cog and you can fall straight to sleep every night. Let's try it. Yeah? How's that? Is that doing it for you? Oh, I have to do it the whole time? Does it, it doesn't load I up? I think, I don't know, you're, you're, the, you're the one that knows. <laughs> How does it work? 
Yes, you just true. Twist. <laughs> right. Exactly not, like not this. Not uh, quick, quickly. Uh, Unless sorry. you like your music in like <laughs> double speed, which some people do. So I have do. to do it myself. It won't play for me. No, you got to do it yourself. Mm. You got to work. Yes. Sorry. You got to work to get your reward. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing in life comes for free. <laughs> Are you cool. from uh, Ohio? Ohio. No, I'm not from Ohio. Which part of uh, the state are you from? Um, Virginia. Cool. Yeah, kind of near DC. West. West Virginia. Yeah, that's where you're from? No, <laughs> clearly not. You should be good at the accents by now. I know, I know. No, we're from... You're learning. Yeah, by DC. Cool. Yeah. I'm from London, actually. Oh, but, uh, cool. I actually just saw you looking at, I don't know, friendship bracelets? I don't know <laughs> what you're looking for with your friends. But I, yes. I thought you were very, very attractive. Oh, actually. thank you. You're welcome. How long are <laughs> you in you. London for? Uh, we're here for until Friday. Cool. You liking it? Yeah. You've it's missed our sunshine, you know. We've had like I know. three days before you I came. Know. It's been a lot of rain, but it's been a lot of yeah, rain. Yesterday and was our first day here, and it was quite rainy. Yeah. Are you yeah. staying in Camden? Um, no. We are in Soho. Mmm. Better. More yeah, like. Yeah. Lot of fun. Lot yeah. of fun. Yeah. Same every day. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. It's nice. All right. Well, it was nice to meet you. It was nice to meet you. What's your name? I'm Emily. Cool. Emily. Well, yeah. uh, before Friday. I think I'm going to actually the north of England on Friday, but I'm like Wednesday or Thursday. If you're around, I would like to take you for a drink somewhere. Oh, okay. Would you Would you like to do that? Sure. Cool. Um, do you have WhatsApp? Um, you I guys do not use have that? WhatsApp. You guys are old fashioned, huh? Yeah. In Virginia, it's just text message or Instagram. Yes. Huh? Yes. That's cool. Okay. Let me drop you a, a text message. Okay. Four four three. Uh, do you want me to do it for you? I am gonna give you the rain so on this one yeah okay I actually live quite close to here. I've just moved to this part of London oh really yeah uh oh I don't know that it'll work like this because my number is different what does it start with is it it's, four, it's so we have less numbers than you mm. but is it four four at the start it's four four three okay so I don't know how that works I think if you chuck a plus in front of it okay that try works. try that your accent, like... Uh, sort of. I don't know. If, let's see if it'll see if it'll send to me. Okay. Let's do this. Okay. Text me and see if it works. I'll I will. And if not, I'll it. just figure out your kind of country code no situation. <laughs> we'll figure out a way to make awesome, it happen. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you. It was okay. nice to meet you. See you later, darling. So what I'm going to do this year and what I'm planning in the next couple of weeks to get started for you guys is a 2020 man's guide to conversation with women. So I'm going to basically condense all of the things that I've learned into a really simple basic structure that's going to allow you to break free from all of this information that's firing at you from all angles and just focus on one simple set of actions that can get you from where you are now to where you want to be without any of the mess and the hassle so that you can eventually have that sense of natural fluidity of sort of thoughtless communication where your subconscious mind is trusted to deliver everything you have to say without you having to worry about it think about it second guess yourself and question every move that you make so the important points to pick up on there is no such thing as a natural every person that seems natural once learned the same structure from a very early age so that he doesn't need to learn and practice that now but if you want to be like that natural and you haven't had those childhood experiences it is helpful to learn some sort of structure the simpler the better from one source preferably and not many sources just like business you focus on the one thing you don't get tangled up in all the possible entrepreneurial ideas you're having you focus on the one you commit to it you stick to it you follow it through and you make it a success that's how i want it to be for your social lives so i'm really looking forward to your guys feedback on some of the content i'm going to be, be releasing towards this system and i'll see you in the next video get outside get approaching the time is here it's 2020 the virus is closing down the lockdown is lifting we're here baby when i do my social recharge courses the next one is the 9th 10th and the 11th of june we go to all the best places in london and i teach you guys how to perfect this approach how to approach beautiful women in the daytime the kind of women that you dream about that you want to be with using this simple system keeping the interaction simple and open 
the next one as I said 10th 11th of June and 12th of June July that is we're going to be going around Bond Street central London a group of guys up to four individuals two spaces are taken we've got two spaces left I'm predicting that they're all going to go in the next couple of days so if you're interested drop me a message and we'll see if we can sign you up from that uh, it's going to be the three days we've got another great coach someone that I, I've been working with a lot lately he's a fantastic coach three to four other guys it's going to be an absolutely amazing time so if you're looking to recharge your social skills and get back into the dating game after the coma that is COVID-19 then join me on the fluid social social recharge course Friday to Sunday the 10th 11th and 12th of July I look forward to seeing you there Sam out <laughs>